Again. <laughs> hey there guys, what's going on and welcome back to our channel. Every day the NBA gives us something new to cherish, be it the players, rising stars or their insane playing skills, we're always left in awe of the athleticism they display. While height is a major component that helps owners decide if they want to draft a player, sometimes they come across an insanely tall individual that blows their mind. This new teenager is one such person, and it is that 14-year-old NBA prospect Abio Dune Atacoke is 7 foot 9. The NBA is a league that has always wowed its fans given the players and their basketball skills. Every year, the draft is a big time for the teams because they get to choose players they want that would represent their team. From LeBron James to Steve Curry, each player went through the stage once to make it to where they are today. One such individual that shows huge prospects in the league today is a teenage Nigerian, Abiodun Atikoke. He's a 14-year-old boy who is taller than any normal grown-up. He is 7 feet 9 inches and is the highlight of the league's headlines today. It's crazy to know that a teenager who just entered puberty was able to cross an insane level of height. All this boy has to do is raise his arm with the ball in his hand and just dunk the ball. His arms reach the tip of the 10 feet tall basketball hoop, making it beyond easy for him to shoot. If he ever makes it into the league, which we can't see why he couldn't, his teammates will only have to pass the ball to him and Atacoke will raise his hand and dunk just by standing at his place. This is absolutely insane. After a video went viral on the internet, everyone was shocked to know its backstory. In the video, we can see the Nigerian center playing basketball with his lads and making a dunk just by raising his arms. When the world found out that this boy was just 14 years of age, everyone went wild. Ah! Again! Ah! Ah! In another video, where Otakoke was working out in the gym with his instructor, one could see his abilities and strength. This video showed the world how this Nigerian boy could actually make it in the league. In the same clip, we hear Otakoke referring to himself as the Big Nija. He already has a name sorted out for himself in case he does get big and enters the NBA. Because Shaquille O'Neal shared this video on the social media platform, one thing is for sure, Otakoke's life will never be the same. Fun fact, Otakoke is 3 inches taller than the tallest man ever to play in the NBA. So even if he ever does make it to the team, he already holds the record for being the tallest. It seems to be working out well for him even before he gets started. One thing's for sure, whoever plays with him would never try to mess with him or even try to defend him because his sheer size wouldn't let them be successful. He would make it to the hoop just by walking and making a shoot just by standing on the ground. Alright, I don't want to sit anyway. <laughs> <laughs> One video that Big Nigel shared on his Instagram, we felt like it was an optical illusion and that it was probably an edit, but it turns out that it was legit. The boy was actually tall and it was nothing like we had ever expected from a 14 year old teenager. The 5 foot 6 inch player standing opposite to him looked like a child and with what we've seen, no one else stands any chance against this beast. He will truly serve as a cheat code for whatever team that picks him up. To rock around, to rock around, that's right, on time is tricky. It's tricky, it's tricky, it's tricky. The best part is, the league wouldn't even realize it. He would just continue to play his part and act fierce, and no one would want to come close to him. He might have made it to the news in America, but there's still a lot of skepticism around his background. Some reports say that Otta Koch is a 21-year-old boy who goes to college, but others say he's still 14 years old. Well, given his height, it is difficult for people to believe that he's still 14 and the confusion is still alive and Otta Koch himself hasn't clarified the facts. Although he jokes about the interest people are taking in his age, but hasn't been able to provide evidence that confirms any piece of news. 
Some reports from Nigeria suggest that Otokoke was 17 years old at the time and was 2.18 meters then too. He is rumored to currently be 18 years of age and was once a student at a sports high school academy in Lagos. He had to leave this institution because of his financial needs. Otokoke has been in Dubai recently to take part in the MPAC Elite Youth League. He hasn't spoken to the public about anything, but the world sees him as the perfect addition to the NBA given his sports skills and height. He might not even train to shoot because he can just do it from the ground. If Otokoke is able to make it to the United States for professional basketball, his career will obviously flourish in no time. He will become a joint record holder alongside a Chinese player who played for the Harlem Globetrotters once. This is an achievement in itself. Then, if he makes it to the NBA with a league team, he will hold a new record for the league's tallest player. Atacoke will shatter the previously held record by Yao Ming and Manute Bolt standing at 7 feet at 6 inches tall. Training to make it to the NBA will prove to be very profitable for Atacoke. Coming from a poor background and being unable to pay for school, this will be a life-changing scenario for him. He probably never realized what his high could get to him and trying for the NBA will show him what he's capable of. He's been part of a competition in Dubai which has already increased his fame. His popularity within the Americans could actually bring him into a life that's better than any he's ever imagined. The media and the sports industry currently has eyes on him and if he's able to provide evidence for his correct age, they might start seeing him as a prospect. The NBA has turned life around for many individuals. Some rose to fame and money from being part of lethal street gangs while others came from a poor background. Their life turned upside down just by investing in their skills and passion and if Adago does the same, he must see himself standing in the league. And as stated before, he will be the life cheat card that any team would get. My team will win because for me, I'm fully prepared to face all the challenges that will come up. This brings us to the end of our video which we hope you guys found insightful. And if you did, go ahead and smash that like button. And if you want more content like this in the future, then all you have to do is hit the subscribe button to follow our channel and press the bell notification to be notified of our latest video when it goes up. And with that, I'll be catching you guys later in another video. Bye now.